If you don't want to stay broke, you need to get rid of these 10 things, like right now. No joke, keeping them around could be totally messing with your wealth, and I'm not even exaggerating. Feng Shui, which is this ancient Chinese practice that's all about creating harmony in your space, says that the stuff you keep at home really affects your energy, and energy, well, it impacts everything, including your money. So, yeah, this is important. First off, get rid of expired drugs. Like, seriously, why are they still in your house? They're not only useless, but according to Feng Shui, they carry bad energy that could block financial flow. Next, if you're still holding on to your kids' old bedding from when they were little, it's time to let it go. Keeping old stuff like that clings to the past and, well, it kind of keeps you stuck, you know? Not good if you're trying to move forward with your money game. And don't even get me started on old shoes you don't wear anymore. If they're just collecting dust, they're also collecting bad energy. Same goes for old clothes you can't wear. If it doesn't fit or it's too worn out, toss it. Seriously, you're just holding on to clutter that could be stopping you from making room for new opportunities, including financial ones. Now, if your wallet is broken, oh, that's a big one. Your wallet is like the symbol of your wealth. And if it's in bad shape, so is your money. Same with a broken phone or portable device. If it's busted, it's not doing you any favors in the wealth department. Time to let it go. Empty flower pots? Yeah, those too. Feng Shui says they symbolize a lack of growth, and you don't want that kind of energy hanging around if you're trying to make money, and if you have an old waste glass fish tank just sitting there, it's like totally stagnant energy. Get rid of it. Rusty tools? Yep, those gotta go too. Feng Shui is all about keeping things fresh and in good condition because it reflects how you take care of your life including your finances. And finally, dead plants. They're, well, dead. And dead things bring in dead energy. You want your space to feel alive and thriving, not stuck and lifeless. So, seriously, go through your house, check for any of these things, and clear them out. Your wallet and your energy will thank you. So, what's still hanging around your house that might be blocking your money flow? Have you cleared out any of these yet? Let me know in the comment section. Like and follow for more videos like this.